Hey there! In the latest Figma updates, a new feature was introduced, Grid, and I'm very excited about it for the potential that it has to be a game changer when it comes to the way that we structure the UI components. The way that we saw it being used was for flexible websites like image galleries and pricing tables, for example. But I wanted to show using a card tile, which is something that is complex enough that allows you to see the potential in it, how something that maybe you will build using auto layout now you can create fully using grid with that say let's get started and you go here to frame i'm going to create this 345 by 450 looks pretty good for what i want i go to the layout functionality tap on grid by default i have the 2x2 two two. for the design that i want i'm going to go with 3x4 let me type here tile and make it a little bit bigger a little bit bolder and that's it here i can just snap straight to it let me add the space for the image make it a little bit rounded now at the copy i had some lowering it zoom here for you guys so you didn't have to see me typing Ta -da -da -da. and then let me make it i think 120 percent or 150 percent to give it a little bit more space i wanted to only show three lines so come in here truncate text and i will do the same and let's see what changed okay so i'm going to snap these to the frame now i realized that i don't have the cta that i wanted to add so i just can come here, come here and add another line go to assets type to add a cta I wonder, I like this one better because I think it will distract less. And let me make it 44. I want to have a favorite option, so add a heart there, a little bit bigger, right? Um, so then position it to the center and do the same trick here. Ta and as you can see, the card is taking shape fairly quick without having to use Chief A, not once. And then I come here, let me add the borders, and we have our beautiful, highly flexible, I don't know if beautiful, uh, but we have our car built, highly flexible. Oh, by the way, uh, this one, I can drag it all the way here, all the way here if I want to have an X, for example, in this space, the same way that I have the heart. Uh, for now, I will get it all the way to the end. And as you can see, it's highly flexible, beautiful. The best part, very clean. You don't have any nesting components, one under the other. And another thing is that this car is looking a little bit tight. Well, fear not, you can just come here and be like, I wanted to be actually 16 spacings overall in between components. Now, there you have it. You want to add more space in between these two. You can also do that. You want to shorten the space. You can apply the same trick that we did before, but this time like this, for example and you can build on top of it using grids, within grids. For example, using one of these templates to have the MacBook Air, I will add 12 grids to be standard. And yeah, here I'm going to just say, this is the mother of the tiles. Okay, take it all the way to the end, snap. Perfect. And then I can just place it here. Oh, by the way, let me add some stroke to the tile so you can see where it ends. And add the padding to the page. Ta -da, ta -da. This is too tight. I can make it 24 by 24, which will be the equivalent to the gutter. So there you have it. And here, if I want, as you can see, the card got a little bit distorted in size. You have full control over it. You can change it by adjusting or changing the grid size or whatever it is. Uh, for now, I will just make it very easy and I will just come here and change it that way. Then control uh, command C. I still say control from my times working with PC, even though it's been over six years, seven years. And uh, then command D, command D, command D, command D, command D, command D. There you have it, fully flexible well you can see it's not uh it, it, it has its hiccups you can you can play around with it a little bit more find out what where i messed up but overall 
you can see the potential that it has to create something really clean very easily very organized and just you can keep building on it and i am pretty excited about it and yeah i just wanted to share it with you all so you can also give it a try bye